Okay, so this is this, this is actually gonna be the last video I upload today. But I, 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 I forgot to tell you guys about this because I've, I've been wanting to to talk about this for a little bit now, for a couple of days when it, when it actually happened to me. But um, I mostly game on my PS3 for the most part, but I do also own an Xbox 360. I don't can't remember the last time I touched my Xbox 360. I actually played it. Um, I think the last game I played was Tales of Vesperia. I was playing it over again for the second time. And yeah, it was a long time ago. It was a while ago. It's been sitting there. So uh I decided to sell it. No point in having it just sitting there when I can get I can get a good amount of money for this Xbox. Cause, I mean, it's the 250 gigabyte slim. It's got connect games. But, you know, I can get I can get a fair amount for it. So I decided to put it on Craigslist. Now I know some people are already thinking, mistake. I don't really like dealing with eBay and shipping stuff and you know all that bullshit. I just want to sell it and get it out. And be done with it. So anyways, I've sold stuff on Craigslist before. Never once, not one time have I had a problem. I know other people have. It's Craigslist. Ooh. I've never had an issue, personally. Anyway, so I go ahead and I put my Xbox on Craigslist. So it's been on there for about a week now. Haven't had too many people, you know, emailing me about it. It's it's a lot of money, so I'm sure it's not gonna it's not gonna sell until somebody who actually is looking to spend that amount of money goes on there and looks. Anyways, it's been there for about a week. Two days ago. I get an email from some lady, Kathy. You know who you are. Yeah, some lady named Kathy. And uh, Kathy's a very strange lady. So she emails me. I get these emails. Hi, you know it's my son's birthday, and I don't have money, but would you be willing to trade? Now, it's crazy. So you get trade offers all the time. But I don't want to trade. I want money. I want the cash. So, sorry. Not, not even for your son's birthday. I'm so bad for that. So, anyways. So, I tell her no. Unless the trade is really worth it. I mean, if she wants to give us something that's valued way more than an Xbox, I guess. So, she emails me again after I tell her no, unless the trade is worth it. Um, she emails me again and she goes, okay, well. And I quote, how about some pussy? What is the world coming to when a woman's pussy is valued at an Xbox 360? When she values it at an Xbox 360? Think about that for a second. Just let that marinate. I've never had anything like that happen to me on the this world. Never. Ever. But that wasn't the only thing that happened. The next one's not quite as bad. I thought that was absolutely just that lady needs prayer or something in her life. But what happened yesterday? I get another offer. Get another email from some dude. Don't remember his name actually. I remember Kathy just because of how I was like, damn Kathy, like really? But uh don't remember the dude's name. But I get another offer from him and he goes, Hey, you still got the Xbox? Yeah, still got the Xbox. Would you be willing to trade? No. This time I only said I just said no. Like I wasn't wanting no other weird ass trade offers. I just said no. He emails me again. I got two ounces of weed. Or, excuse me, he didn't say weed. He said, I'll trade you two ounces of med, which is marijuana, but to save himself, 
I guess if I was going to go to the police, if you have a car. You really think I'm going to believe that the only way you're going to make that trade is if I have a medical, mar medical marijuana car? Mm -mm. I get off a pussy and weed. Two ounces of weed. Two ounces. Damn. For an Xbox. Craigslist, Craigslist, Craigslist. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm.